everyone, welcome to my craft room. I just have a small Dollar Tree haul that I wanted to share with you guys today. So let's get started. I picked up a few more flowers from the Dollar Tree. I found these really pretty uh, sunflowers that I want to use in some of my craft projects for the fall. I thought they looked really nice. And these are mini flowers with grass, they're called. And I picked up two of those. I thought they were really nice. And I also picked up another bunch of the cattails. And I'm going to add that to my giant stash. You can see that I have back here that I've been picking up a few every time I go to the Dollar Tree. So I can stock up on all of those things. Um, I found some of these really pretty hair clips at the Dollar Tree. They had a lot of different um, designs, I guess, for back to school. But I wore these pretty much every day to keep the hair out of my face. So I thought they were pretty nice. And there's 12. Not bad for a dollar. I also picked up some of the Jot glue tape. I've never used it before. I don't know if anybody's tried these. Um, I'm going to attempt to make my first pocket letter one of these days, and uh, I'm just going to give this a try. So let me know if anybody has used these before and how they work. I also picked up two uh, things of ribbon for a project that I want to do this week. I found an orange. This is a, um, this is a sheer ribbon. And I picked up a brown. This is a gross grain ribbon. So I got one of each of those. And uh, there's six yards on there. So that's not too bad. Not for a buck. And then I also found these. I'm not a big fan of glitter, but I do like the real fine glitter. And they had a bunch of these different packages. These are more pinks and purples and reds that I want to try to uh, use on some things. And then they had in the white and black and silver, just little packages. I'll probably have it all over the place. It'll be glittery for weeks. And then I found um, like gold and bronze. I thought they were really pretty. So we'll see how they work out. I love the real fine stuff. It just seems to look so much better on things. Then I picked up a pack of this potpourri, which I can't see what it says. This is the apple cinnamon. It's four ounces. Um, I want to make a project with some potpourri. I'm not quite sure how it smells, but I kind of wanted it for all the different things that it had in there. There's little pine cones and shells and all kinds of things. So we'll see how it smells, but I really just want it for the way that they look. Then I picked up another pair of these scissors, kitchen scissors. They're not like the sturdiest scissors you could ever get. They're just called kitchen shears. But they do work great for like when you want to open bags, salad bags, whatever. So they come in really handy in the kitchen. I also found these stickers. They're a, they're lace stickers, puffed lace. And they actually feel like real lace. So I'm not sure, but I picked up four of these packs of the lace that I thought would be nice for around the holidays to decorate different things with. So we'll see how they work out. So they thought they were really nice. These have more like roses and things. And this one just has some really pretty designs. So we're going to give those a try. And I also found that I usually go to the Dollar Tree on Mondays, which is probably the worst day to go because a lot of the things I was looking for were the shelves were just empty. So I'm thinking the day after the weekend is not the best. So I think I may start going on Wednesdays or Thursdays. But I did find a pack of the shimmery metallic jewelry tattoos that I've seen a lot of people hauling. And I'm going to give that as a gift. And I just thought they were really cute. I don't know how they work either, but they looked really cool. And some little girl may just really like these. I also picked up another two pack of rulers. I'm always using rulers you now in my craft projects and I'm always misplacing rulers. 
So I have another two of those. They're wooden rollers. It's a two pack. They have all different colors and it was the school supplies. So I thought that was a pretty good deal. And then these I haven't seen before. I picked up this little Coke glass. It looks like a Coke can. I know a lot of people collect Coca-Cola things. I've seen Coke um, glasses there before. And I picked up one of the regular. I think I've seen these there before. But I have not seen the ones that look like a can. So I thought that was really cute. And I picked up a just a regular Coca-Cola glass. We do have Coke fans in the house. And then I picked up a little Coca-Cola like juice glass. And I haven't seen these there before either, so I thought that was cute. The one thing that was stocked up was the washi tape section. And um, let me get my glasses. I found this brown like diamond design. I thought that was nice. It's the first time I've been there where the whole rack was full. And then I found ones with <clears throat> butterflies on a black with some stars and all kinds of cute things. And then I picked up another butterfly one that I thought was real pretty. That would look great like on an envelope or a gift or something. So yeah, I was real happy with those. They had a lot of different kinds this time. And then I picked up for a project that I'm doing for these um, picture frames. 3 by 5 by 3.5 by 5 and I like them because they have the matting on the inside and I'm going to attempt to do a DIY something that I saw on Pinterest that I want to give a shot and I will share that with you guys and then another DIY I'm going to do is with this 5 by 7 picture frame also with the matting on the inside and a little chalkboard so I will show you guys what I'm up to with these in a couple of days. And that's pretty much all I got this week at the Dollar Tree. Like I said, next week I think I'm going to try to go Wednesday or Thursday and see if maybe the shelves are stocked a little bit better. And hopefully I can find some of the cute fall items that I've seen other people hauling that our Dollar Tree doesn't have in yet. And also I'm looking for the press-on nail or the glue-on nails, the real pretty ones. They had none at my Dollar Tree this weekend or this Monday. So, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Have a great day.